Um, the first. Do you want me looking straight in the camera too? Straight here. You're going to okay. look here the whole time. Okay. So we've reached an amazing moment where women and men are almost essentially equal in their salary and in their promotion and their level of seniority in companies where they're privacy officers. If I remember the research correctly, women actually have a little bit of an edge when they get their privacy credentials from the IAPP, which I'm sure the folks at the IAPP are really proud of. A lot of people want to know why there are so many women in privacy or why the numbers are so equal. And I think it reflects that it's a brand new area of law, of thinking about policy and compliance in the private sector, in government, really in the world. And it reflects that the numbers coming out of school are more equal than they used to be. And that it was a wide open field that would give people a chance. People of all backgrounds, all educational experiences, and all viewpoints. And I think it's a great moment for people entering the field still to get to senior levels of governments and companies and really express their own viewpoints on privacy. So a lot of people have said women think about privacy differently or women are different kinds of managers or whatever. I don't want to generalize about people and their skills and their expertise. I know the polling shows that I'm wrong though, that women care about privacy in higher numbers when asked the question on the Pew Internet Research polls. Um, I do think women manage differently in my experience, and there's some hard wiring there that we should probably all think about psychologically. And do we think about privacy differently? Perhaps, perhaps because we're managing so many different roles at home, at work, whatever, we're thinking about privacy and how it means different things to different people. And that's, I think, the skill that the best privacy officers offer, whether they're men or women or whatever their background is in education and, and experience, is that I know what I think about privacy, but I also am humble enough to realize that that's one person's opinion and we need to build policies and procedures and laws and regulations that reflect human individuality and, and choice. I think you're good. I don't think we need to take any more.